What's up everybody, my name is Jimmy and it's time to shuffle and cut with a fresh build. This is Esper Drakehaven in Rivals of Ixalan Standard. Before we get started, smash that like button if you like this video. Also subscribe and hit that bell icon so you don't miss anything from Mind Sculpting MTG. Let's start off by talking about our win conditions. Four Drakehaven and three Faith of the Devoted. With both of these enchantments we get to take advantage of the cycling mechanic. With Drakehaven, we can pay one mana to create a 2-2 Drake creature token any time that we cycle or discard a card. Faith of the Devoted, however, allows us to drain our opponent for two for the same cost. The idea is to cycle through our deck while creating creature tokens to attack and block with while draining our opponent for the win. But we can't succeed without a great selection of cycling cards, so let's check them out. We have to have counter spells to thwart our opponent's game plan. Four Sensor help us disrupt our opponent's early plays while netting us card advantage in conjunction with our strategy. Next, we need life gain if we hope to survive, so let's play four Renewed Faith. When we cycle Renewed Faith, we can gain two life, otherwise if we cast it, we can gain six. While playing this deck, you have to use your instincts to know when the time is right to cycle it or to cast it. To keep our hand full, we're playing four Hieroglyphic Illumination and three Pull from Tomorrow. In the early game, we can cycle away Hieroglyphic Illumination to find the answers we need. Pull from Tomorrow works great with our strategy as we have to discard a card after we draw X cards. With both, we keep gas in the tank while synergizing with Drakehaven and Faith of the Devoted. Finally, we have four cast out to answer any permanent that could pose a threat to our game plan. Don't be afraid to cycle one away during the early game as we have more tricks up our sleeves. Speaking of tricks, let's check out the rest of our arsenal. We are a control deck after all, so let's play two negate and one essence scatter. We need to answer threats like Approach of the Second Sun and God Pharaoh's Gift, while Essence Scatter takes care of threats like Hazard and the Scarab God. Also, as a catch-all, we have two Disallow. This allows us to say no to Chandra Ultimates, Mechanized Production Triggers, or anything else we might encounter. Finally, we need Board Wipes. Three Settle the Wreckage and one Fumigate help us take care of our opponent's board state, allowing us to stay alive long enough to finish them off. Don't forget, swing out with your drakes first before you fumigate. Now let's check out the 25 land mana base. To help thin the deck and fix our mana, we're playing four Evolving Wilds. To maximize our cycling ability, a playset of Fetid Pools and Irrigated Farmland are a necessity. Next, we're playing four Concealed Courtyard. And finally, for our basics, we have four Islands, four Plains, and one Swamp. Now let's talk sideboard. Always keep in mind your 15 card sideboard should always depend on what your local meta looks like, but this is what I got for you. Against Control, trade out Essence Scatter, Fumigate, 3 Settle the Wreckage, and a copy of Renewed Faith for 2 Negate, 3 Torrential Gear Hulk, and another Disallow. For aggro matchups, trade out 2 Negate, 1 Pull from Tomorrow, 1 Cast Out, 1 Sensor, and 1 Hieroglyphic Illumination for 3 Authority of the Consoles, 1 more Fumigate, and 2 Archfiend of Ifnir. For mid-range or combo decks, trade out Fumigate, 1 Renewed Faith, and Essence Scatter for 3 Duress. Use this as a guide. This isn't an exact science, but a starting point. Each match will vary from game to game, so use information from each game to guide your sideboarding decisions. That's all for today. Let me know what you think about Esper Drakehaven in the comments section below. Also, let me know if you like the new format for Let's Talk Sideboard. As always, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe so you don't miss anything from Mind Sculpting MTG. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next upkeep.